In this pygmonic, we'll cover urinary excretory anatomy, shown as the X crater. Primarily located in the kidneys, this system is responsible for filtration and excretion in the body. First, you should be familiar with the regions of the kidney, starting with the renal medulla, the medusa character, which is the inner layer of the kidney. Inside the renal medulla are pyramids, each of which contain thousands of nephrons. The outermost part of the kidney is called the renal cortex, portrayed as cortez on the cortex of the kidney, whose main function is to filter blood and remove unwanted substances out of the body. In the cortex, blood is brought to the functional units of the kidney, known as nephrons, the nerf darts in the nephron. Blood is filtered through Bowman's capsule, the Bowman, an eponym for a structure that surrounds the glomerulus and prevents larger macromolecules from entering the nephron. Now, excretion starts as afferent arteries bring blood to the glomerulus, represented by the glomere, which is a cluster of arterioles that collects blood in the kidney. The filtered blood, called filtrate, moves into the proximal tubule, shown as the P rocks at the opening of the tube. Here, ions, organic molecules, and water are absorbed and travel through the loop of Henle, explained by the loop of Hens in this image. The last major absorption area of the nephron is the distal tubule, the disco tube, and from here urine moves to the collecting duct, the collection duct, to become more concentrated. The ureter, shown as the U rooster, takes urine out of the nephron and pushes it to the urinary bladder, depicted as the urinal with bladder. Finally, when urination occurs, urine passes through the urethra, illustrated as the urethra. So very quickly, let's review urinary excretory anatomy. The renal medulla describes the inner layer of the kidney, while the outermost part of the kidney is called the renal cortex. Within the medulla, thousands of nephrons, which are the functional units of the kidney, work to filter the blood, concentrate filtrate, and later excrete it. Blood is filtered by Bowman's capsule as it enters the nephron, after which it is brought to the glomerulus, which is a cluster of capillaries derived from the afferent arterioles. The proximal tubule is where many ions, organic molecules, and vitamins are absorbed, forming the initial filtrate of the nephron. The filtrate then moves through the loop of Henle, where water and salts are absorbed and reabsorbed, up to the distal tubule, which connects to the collecting duct. It is at this site that urine is concentrated and later sent to the ureters. The ureters push urine to the urinary bladder for storage, and when urination occurs, it passes through the urethra before leaving the body as urine. The excrator is a place where urine exits the body and filters the blood. It all starts with Medusa at the inner layer of the kidney. She's filled with rage now because she's planning a party and her hubby, Cortez, trashed the place with nutrients. So she demands him to clean the place up. He quickly runs to the outer layer of the kidney and begins to soak up all the spilled nutrients with tissues. But it wasn't enough. So he commands the squire to do the rest of the job with absorbent, spongy little nerf darts. So the squire draws back her bow man and shoots down the nephron of the kidney to soak up any nutrients Cortez may have spilt from the outside. His squire is the beautiful glow mare and she shoots with precision. But the darts had to go through some obstacles on its way. First, the tube was blocked by pea rocks, which soaked up ions, organic molecules, vitamins, and water. However, the glow mare's nerf darts made it through, down to the loop of hens. The thirsty hens in the descending loop drink the water the nerf darts drip down, while the hungry hens in the ascending loop eat up all the salt. For the rest of the story, check out Picmonic.com and sign up for a free account. There, you can also take Picmonic's quiz. The quiz automatically sets up your daily quiz by using spaced repetition algorithms based on the questions you've missed or struggled with to make sure you study what you need when you need to. And while you're there, check out the rest of our Renal Anatomy Picmonics. We've got all the content you'll need to remember. Everything from proximal tubule, distal tubule, loop of Henle, collecting duct, renal corpuscle, and so much more. So you can lock down on everything you need to know forever. Play, quiz, and spaced repetition. Efficient, effective, and research proven to increase exam scores.